Crystal Collector. Today we're in Utah and we're gonna go dig for some trilobite fossils. These things are millions of years old. They've been buried forever. Let's check them out. All right, I'm all signed in. Let's go dig some fossils. Um, the next one on my list here is gonna be this here, this Paranopsis interstricta. After the fossil briefing, they have this cool map and you can pin your location. What? Wilmington, North Carolina. So we're gonna go ahead and walk down to the pit, you guys. It's just a short walk. All right, we're here at the pit. Well, one of the pits. We're gonna be digging here for a little bit. Here's one of the many pits that you can dig here. We're gonna go dig through the section down here that's 500 million year old layers. All right, we're getting ready. And it rained a lot last night. I just looked down and look at this. Here's a piece right here on the surface. It's not a complete full piece. It's missing the cheeks, but look at that. <laughs> so what is a trilobite? It's actually an invertebrate marine life that lived more than 550 million years ago, but they are now extinct. These hard shell critters roam the sea floor and coral reefs in search of food. So we've got the original layering right here. What you want to do at this location is just break out sections. And as you're breaking them out, you can see the pieces, or as you split those down into smaller chunks, you'll find them as well. Sometimes it's nice to go ahead and clean your top layer off and get right down to the nitty gritty. So I've been digging with this hammer here. It's a little bit small. Went back and I would suggest if you guys are gonna come out, bring in a little bit larger one, maybe even a good chisel. And look, you're gonna be able to then go in hard. And once you get them out like that, that's so much quicker than using this other tool, you guys. So just a little tip there. Thought I'd add that in for you. <laughs> All right, this in there. Oh, nice. All right, let's see what we got here. Uh, nothing yet. This is a large piece. Let's break it down. Huh? Where they at, though? No. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, there it is. Look at that. You can barely see it. Let's see if we can expose it a little bit more here. Oh, I broke it. Oh, it no. Broke. We'll have to go again, guys. But there you go. Starting to get into them. <laughs> All right. There's a pretty big plate about to come up. All right, got a single here. I'm going to try to get it out. Oh, where'd it go? Here it is. All right, guys. Check this out. Oh, nice. Got him. <laughs> it's gone now. <laughs> oh, man. Actually did find it and all cleaned up. Look at that beauty. What do you think, Matrix? Big deal. Ooh. Ooh, where's the cast? Oh, really? There's got to be. Oh. See that cast? Yeah, that's a big one. There's got to be. There it is. Look, there it is right there. Oh. <laughs> See it? Yeah. Oh, it's almost complete. Look at that. Oh, that's so cool. Sweet. One of the better ones of the day. So far. Yep. Been here half an hour. I'm going to attempt to use this super thin wedge to break this piece down. You don't even have to hit it too hard. Just barely, barely. Oh. <laughs> you don't want to hit your finger. Man, maybe this one is oh. tougher. This one's got a. This one's kind of tough. Yeah, you can sell sometimes. This sometimes shell, they can split easy. Yeah, let's go from the center. Okay, oh, we got a full crack here. And we got a lot of little things, nothing crazy. There's a few trilobites, one, two, and some body parts. Let's 
We're still looking for that two to three incher. We're gonna find it. Just wait and see, you guys. Getting them, getting them. And we notice this huge area here has these striations. So we're just gonna break them off. And as we pull these up, you don't ever know. Oh yeah, look at that. That whole piece is coming up. Oh yeah. Two. Go straight in here. Let me move some. Clean, yeah, let me clean some of this up for you here. Here's a big chunk. Oh, <laughs> dude, right there. That's the oh biggest one of the day. Oh my goodness. For us, I don't know. It's kind of weird. Yeah, it'll clean up. We we'll have to get that cleaned up a bit. Look at wow. that. That'll be tough to stay keeping that matrix. Here. You see our trial bite here. I'm going to go in behind it. Oh, look at that. Wow, perfect. perfect. All right, so now what we want to do, guys, we, we kind of want to keep it in the matrix. I like them that way. I'm going to set this piece up, right? Take this sharp end right over the end. Boom. Oh, nice. Not bad. All I'm it takes go is pop. one. Oh, you know what? Yeah, let's pop that off. And look at that. We'll have to take our Dremel and we'll Dremel this up, clean it up, and that'll be a beautiful piece. This location has several different types of trilobites. The Orathia kingi is one of the most common. Ooh, looks like that whole piece is about to come up. Oh, yeah. oh it is. Oh, nice. Dude, that's it. Yeah. There it is. <laughs> oh, dude. Oh. Okay. If here there's we go. not a trilobite in here, then I don't know where they are. All right. This, you want to just flip it over and see if there's anything on the bottom? If not, we have a... No, nope, nothing on the bottom. Well, but you guys, look at this. Look at that. We have a beautiful, beautiful rock to crack open. Ooh, another really nice split here, right down the center. Ooh. And look at that. Right there, guys. Look at this. Right out of there. He doesn't have his cheeks or her cheeks. A little small one. Oh, look at that one sticking out. The butt. <laughs> Let's see if we can get that out, guys. That could be tough. But if I go behind it, just like so, I believe. Well, maybe not, huh? It's it's kinda, just... It looks cool like, like that in Matrix. <laughs> well... No, we need the whole thing. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's so cool. No, yeah. That's pretty neat. So a little bit of breaking and some luck. You can make them look pretty good and it's still isn't cleaned up. Walking over to the other section, you can see they've got some fresh diggings going on. We're gonna check it out. Ooh, <laughs> what do you think about that? I don't know, I hope we don't get flooded. We made it over to the pit, and what I've noticed is there's a huge area where they've thrown some dirt around. And normally I wouldn't go through this stuff, but there was a nice rain just last night. And look at this, right on the surface. I think Dylan found one already too, right? Yeah. Another one is getting bigger. All right, Dylan done spotted one here. Check it out. And it looks to me like it, it is loose. Yeah, I was going to say, it looks like it's loose. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Right out of there. Look at that impression. Nice. Sweet. There you go. Appreciate it. Made it to the other section here. It's huge. You can see all these piles. And ridges. This is the area you want to be digging in all the way down. They've really got a nice setup here for you guys to come out and find these awesome trilobite fossils. You guys, this is no joke. I'm walking around. I'm checking these pilings out, tailings, because it's rain. Where'd they go? There they are. Look at this. I look down and two right beside each other. Oh man, I thought that, look, it's unfortunate. That one's not full, but it's huge. That one, well, it's gonna come right out of the matrix, I bet. Oh, no, oh, oh, it broke. But that's still cool, we got the, 
that's still cool we got the body there but that was kind of neat just to look down and see those two oh. Utah Nevada area this time of year we're gonna get some rainstorms check it out well here we are and it's raining like crazy Whew, we barely made it back hopefully we'll have a few more minutes to dig the rain has pretty much stopped Earlier it was a little too hot for Matrix and there was a lot of people here. So we're gonna let Matrix run around and we're gonna go do a quick round of surface collecting after that hard rain. Who knows what we'll find. Let's go boy. So there's got to be some stuff on the surface. Come on, boy, let's find those trilobites. Everybody's having a good time after this rain. And I'm going to find some trilobites on the surface. There's got to be some. So far, found a few pieces out after that rain shower. What are you doing, boy? Come on, check this one out, look. Come on, boy, look. <laughs> so anyway, there's one right here. Could be the best of the day. It looks like a complete trilobite. We'll get it cleaned up. So here's a few of them cleaned up. You can see the beautiful formation of these trilobites. What an epic place, you guys. Check it out. This location is open to the public. Check them out. They do have a Facebook page, as you see here. So, guys, you got to come check this place out. Oh, wow. What? Check this out. This is a nice shop. You guys got to come check it out. I have some links in the description. Look at this. Oh, look at these geodes. Wow, look at these huge amethyst geodes. What do you think? It's unreal. Be sure to check them out. The Bug House. Be sure to check out the Crystal Clubhouse on Facebook. Lots of giveaways. And we're going to be opening up some new locations to dig crystals and amethyst just for the Clubhouse members. What?